and a 30-60-90 triangle. The length of the hypotenuse is equal to 6. What is the length of the shortest side? A. Is it 2? Letter B. Is it 3? Letter C. 3 square root of 2. Or letter D. 3 square root of 3. Before we will solve the problem, let me tell you first that there is a special relationship among the measures of the sides of a 30-60-90 triangle. Okay, let me draw first the said triangle. This is 90 degrees angle. And this one is 30 degrees. And lastly we have 60 degrees. This is the shorter leg. Longer leg. And lastly the hypotenuse. Remember that. Hypotenuse side is always the side. Opposite the 90 degrees angle. Now, let's go back to the question. We are asked to give the length of the shortest side. Note that a 30-60-90 triangle is commonly encountered right triangle whose sides are in the proportion of 1 is 2, square root of 3 is to 2. So, the measures of the sides are x, then x times square root of 3, and 2x. So we can say that in a 30-60-90 triangle, the length of the hypotenuse is twice the length of the shorter leg, while the length of the longer leg is square root of 3 times the length of the shorter leg. Using this proportion, we can now calculate the shortest side of the triangle. Since the shortest side is half the length of the hypotenuse, we will just have to divide 6 by 2 to get the length of the shortest side. Since 6 divided by 2 is equal to 3, therefore, the length of the shortest side is just 3. This is because 2x is equal to 6. We equated 2x with 6. And 6 is the length of our hypotenuse. Solve for x. Divide 2 on both sides. So, x is equal to 3. That's it. So the correct answer is, letter B, the length of the shortest side is 3. That's all for this video. If you have some clarifications and violent reactions, leave it in the comment section below. You can watch this next. Thank you.